Hi everyone, welcome to Cooking in the Kitchen with Tootsie. A little while ago, I posted a video of a strawberry shortcake. And it was just a brief 22 second clip of um, what I had made. But, I, had to, I thought about it and I took that down and I said, you know what? You guys, I love you to death. Thank you for your support. My old subscribers, my new subscribers, I really appreciate it. I had to come back and I had to do this video right. So let's get started. Right here is you'll see the lady fingers, okay? Get a tin pan like this or a plastic pan, whatever. Just enough so you can be able to lay everything out. I already got everything pre-prepared, okay? The strawberries. Um, I get these. You can use fresh strawberries if you want to, but the only reason that I use these and I choose these is because of the juice. You want to get the, unless you be able to just, you know, take the fresh strawberries, you know, with salt, and, I mean, sugar and water and just let them sit and, you know, marinate it and then you can get the juice. But instead of doing that, I just get this. It's not that much. Um, stop and shop. So... I take a little bit of sugar, add in here, and your vanilla instant pudding. You can do the cooked pudding or the instant pudding. This time I did the cooked pudding. Okay, and that's that. And of course, some whipped cream. You can either, I have a video to show you how to do um, your homemade whipped cream but this time I'm just going to use this I still had some of this left over so I'm just going to use the rest of this and we got everything laid out in the pan and now I'm going to take the strawberries and I'm just going to pour this whole thing in here And then you just basically just move it around so that way it can be able to cover your lady fingers. And don't worry about it because once you put this in the refrigerator, every once it really cools off really good, everything is going to incorporate beautifully. So don't worry about, oh, it's too juice, you know, the juice and everything. Trust me. It's going to go into the refrigerator for quite a few hours, and once you take it out, it's perfect. So here, I make sure that I have all my strawberries covering. See there? Now, the next step, you will take your vanilla pudding. I put it in the freezer for a little while because, like I said, I didn't do the instant. I did the cook because I missed mistake and bought a uh, cook and serve pudding. So that's it's a little hot, but that's okay because all this is going to go in the refrigerator. Or you can put it in the freezer. It does not matter. Goof proof. Very simple recipe. Make it yourself within minutes. I'm like that. So don't don't worry about it. I make sure I don't leave. I don't like to leave, even though I would eat this, you know, take the spoon and finish this bowl out. But I try to get all of it as much as I can. There. Now, what you would do is take your whipped cream hope I got enough whipped cream oops Get all that out of there. 
and just spread it. Might have to fix me some uh, some homemade whipped cream. Just might. Let's see here. Trying to get all of it out of here. And like I said, once you put this in the refrigerator for uh, some hours, once it cools, everything is going to come together beautifully. And when you cut into this, everything is in layers. Just nice. I just made it, y'all. Just made it. That I might have to whip out my uh, heavy cream, heavy cream in my blender, which and I have no problems with doing. Okay, and just layer that. And voila, there you go. There you go. I'm gonna take some aluminum foil, and plus it's really hot in the kitchen. You know, take my advice, cool your kitchen off first. My air conditioner is in another room. So cool your kitchen off first um, uh, before you start on this because cream and, you know, and plus I got the uh, cooked um, vanilla pudding, so. But I'm going to hurry up and fold this. See there? Everything is together. When this gets really cold, it'll stiffen back up and it'll be ready to go. So I'm going to take my lemon foil. Tie it in really good. And put this, place this in the refrigerator. like five or six hours. I really want to let this cool really good. And there you go. Voila. <laughs> so thank you for joining me today. Um, always feel free to comment, subscribe. Um, I try to get back with your comments as fast as I can. And I really appreciate you guys. Thank you very much. This is the strawberry shortcake. Um, easy to make within minutes. Throw it in the refrigerator, let it cool, and dig in. Bye-bye.